So hello and welcome. Thanks for diving in in five minutes. GitLab monitoring um, uh, with uh, me, Alex Das, um, solutions architect here at, at GitLab. So I'm going to show you um, really in a nutshell how you can quickly enable um, Grafana um, to display the metrics which are kind of already present on your um, GitLab package installation. So we're focusing on the Omnibus package installation. Um, to get these metrics here very quickly. Why I'm doing that? I see a lot of customers like not having any visibility, what's going on, and then I'm um, thinking when things get slow, what could it be? So very good, just like enabling some visibility um, at the very beginning um, to get that. So it's very easy. Um, basically, what I've done is um, I have installed um, GitLab, the GitLab package on Google Cloud, just following the official documentation here, basically, um, yeah, and then um, editing the config file. So basically, spawn an instance, used Ubuntu, um, did the package install according to um, the documentation, um, uh, so like most people, um, and then just like um, switching to my instance here, um, and configuring some things. So basically what we're going to do is like the main um, config file and we're going to configure um, this accordingly. Um, very simple. So all you need to do in here is you get a public IP address from Google. Um, basically we use let's encrypt here um, just to obtain a valid certificate. So I highly recommend just do that. Um, get a domain basically. Enter your email address here. Um, get a domain um, in my uh, in my case, that's gitops.art, right? And just register um, on your DNS provider the um, public uh, IP address um, with, um, yeah, with your provider that, that points there was. And then during the reconfigure, you will get a certificate. Very nice, right? Um, so what you want to do is to enable Grafana. So there is a section already in, um, but Grafana isn't enabled per default. So basically just like go to that section, search Grafana, enable it, um, set an admin password, so in my case that's GitLab one explanation mark, um, and then just like set disable login form to false because otherwise there will be only like GitLab SSO um, be available, okay? So then after you've set that, basically you just like do a sudo a GitLab control reconfigure and, and that's going to like um, restart all the services and make that new configuration available. So for the sake of the video, um, I've done that before, uh, you'll see that. Um, and then, well, what you can do is you can go to your instance. What you see here in my case, that's gitops.fun, right? If I look at the um, certificate again, so basically you see that is issued by Let's Encrypt, so everything is fine. And yeah, the only thing I did, I just like um, added a group here that we have something to see. So the nice thing is like, you don't have to do anything more. So you just like go to gitops.art, right? And you go to the Grafana endpoint, which is basically, you see here, just like a dash and then Grafana. Um, and on your instance, even there is usually the dash matrix, which isn't accessible yet, but so basically here is my Grafana endpoint, um, which is enabled by the configuration which I've shown you. And you have some you have some dashboards in here. So per default, even we add the omnibus dashboards, and then you see like the metrics for the most important services. Um, and that can be very, very helpful, right? You can create your custom dashboard on that, but it will really help you to just like look into issues and if you assume that there is an issue on the application side it's very easy to determine whether um the response times maybe went up right whether there is more queuing um or basically um just like um yeah yeah just like the general uh, performance or uptime which you have um from the instance so very good is that service platform metrics here we see kind of like the service availability um, you see that here in general, which is very good because this is a new instance. And then, of course, um, the overall um, overview, which we're having here. Um, so where was it? Yeah, the overview, which just gives you a nice dashboard about that. So make use of it. It's there. Um, so for now, we're doing a lot of like efforts into the monitoring space. So a lot of more integrations will come. But for now, this is a very, very good um, option for you um, to leverage. 
Um, so I encourage you um, to do that.